Welcome back to Builders of Greece, this new city builder that just released in early access in ancient Greece, of course, as the title says. In the last first two episodes, you know, we have already covered some of the basics. We have built our marketplace or Agora in the middle. We've started to sprawl, you know, houses. We've started to have also services like over here. We are giving wine to our people. We have started to even upgrade the houses to the second level. We have a second tier of population here and that's to make a couple of other resources like the planks. But now, at the end of the last episode, we unlocked also the technology tree and I started making a few technology. Some of them are you know, improving the efficiency, for example, of my stone extraction or wood cutting, but also some of them just gave me access to new resources. Like we have now medicine, we have textile, olive, and wheat. So this is what we're gonna focus on in this episode. We really want to start making some of those new productions in particular because my people actually want this. If you look over here, for example, they want beer. If you look at these ones, they want beer, but they also want oil lamps and robes. And of course, getting also some um, doctors would be great. Now, by the way, you may have realized that this is not the music that we had in the first two episodes. I did mention I quite like the music in the first few episodes. But then I got a copyright on that music uh, in YouTube. So now we have some nice annoying road music. Let's go. So we want to start building some of those resources. Some of them will be in tier one, but some of them will also be in tier two. You can see a lot of new resources there. So let's go starting, I think, with uh, medicine. You know, I'm uh, actually worried that we're going to have a problem there. So medicine, we're going to have a healer um, house. That has a great radius, um, not perfect, but you know, if I put it over here, or maybe I put two, you know, put one at the bottom, uh, there's actually no space there, but yeah, maybe we put two, one at each, you know, corner, one here and one there. So that is taking some of these people, but we do have quite a bit of people, so I'm not too worried. And we're also going to want some herbs. So the, it is it is also again taking that second level of people. And we want, we want a forest to get quite a good uh, production. So here should be fine. Let's try with one first. You can check in the production if that's going to be enough or not. All right. Um, we're gonna need more people though for this, so let's go. Let's upgrade a couple more of these. Okay. Then second uh, is I want to do the production that's gonna be both here and there, right? The beer. So let's go for the beer. I think in tier one here we have the wheat farm. Uh, it's gonna take two tools, and we don't have any tools anymore. So we just need to make sure we buy some. That's fine. We have a good amount of money right now. So I'm not too worried. Okay, so we're gonna need to wait a bit for this, you know, a, a new <laughs> guy to come. In the meantime, you know, this wheat to transform into beer. Where is the beer? Here, brewery. It's also gonna take some tools. It's gonna use the wheat and the ceramic to make some beer. So in the meantime, is there anything else we can do? No, they all need tools. Sorry, I should have bought some tools <laughs> before starting the episode because everything seems to be requiring tools and we cannot actually make tools yet. We would be able to do so if we were to unlock over here the Bronze Age. So we'll do it as the next one. Uh, but hopefully I have a merchant coming now. So it's going to give me 20. That's fine. Okay. Thank you. Please go for it. Of course, don't hesitate to tell me in the comments below if you have any questions, things you want to see in this Let's Play. Also comments that you have, you know, for the developers. I'm sure they'll be keen to hear. But yeah, we have now the tools. So I'm going to pause the game by pressing space and then go here. Alors, this is probably going to need water, right? So let's put it over here. I'm going to put it here. We're going to 
put one there and then here one two three four and then one more over here good so that will be one i don't know if one is gonna be enough we're gonna try now you could put the building right here but what we're gonna do instead is put a road to go more this side so we don't waste too much of the water space so let's go we want now over here no sorry over here beer brewery we may need a second warehouse at some point because you know this is quite a lot on one warehouse but um, so far so good there's 10 workers right i don't see i mean you can see one two three four five usually but not 10 so it should be fine uh should be fine now here it is we have started to provide health so that's great i don't think we really see it in terms of like happiness or anything like this or maybe we do maybe we do um is there a detail of happiness over here maybe population happiness level yeah it seems like the happiness level has just increased so it's probably thanks to the healer house i would love to see the bonus but yeah i don't see it it's fine now we do have enough herbs it seems so that's good so let's continue with others for example oh we are low on ceramic so actually sorry maybe we should increase this we do have more clay oh, what's that oh we're out of stone there okay so in classic city builder uh, you know problems we're starting to have actually this just finished because you can see that this one still has one in storage but yeah as i was saying in class uh, classic city building fashion we're going to start having to solve problem all the time to stay afloat now this is a bit of stone and a bit of stone there so i think we need to start expanding this side one here one there we're gonna put a warehouse next to them like here a road the road is not needed by the way for you know stone deposit like this but it just makes it easier right so let's go something like this good so that's going to help with stone this one we can delete this one we need to wait for it to deliver the one here and i wanted also more clay right so let's find the clay deposit we have one here can i actually put two on the same clay deposit if i have the space mm. we don't really have the space that's the problem so that's not working and here can i can put a second one i think we can here so let's do it here okay because this is unlimited so that's not a problem and then we just put a ceramic building because every, basically everything uses ceramic so that's why we're gonna need a lot but yeah we should be we're looking over here at uh, the beer and also we can you know in a few minutes check uh, over here where is it the beer here uh, it still says zero that's strange that's strange we may need a few minutes to get in the groove of thing let's say but anyway now that we have this first one should we move to the Wait, actually, do they need... Yeah, they need rubs. So let's move to that one. Flax plantation. Actually, if I put it here, this way I don't block any of the space there. Okay. So now we have one flax plantation. Let's also put an olive garden or grove while we're here good so that's definitely my farm area oh this is a big one actually and it cannot rotate because it's three by three how many do we need and we need four damn um uh, 
just outside of the range so we're gonna need to change that do the same thing where we're gonna put this basically on the outside free let me see that's fine ah oh, that is not fine okay not good sorry about that uh, i haven't made a perfect layout yet <laughs> for all of these buildings so hopefully like this should be fine one two three four yeah okay so we're not gonna start we're going to start making olives and flax now we're gonna want maybe to use oh by the way yes for the warehouses you need your buildings to be in range of a warehouse right like this is in range of those warehouse but then it's sort of a global uh, warehouse system where all the warehouses are connected so you don't need to put for example the tailor or workshop you don't need to put it here you can put it there and that's fine at least so far that's how it feels to me we'll see so this is going to need even more ceramic by the way oh and actually this is going to make olive oil but i don't think we need that but then i'm gonna need olive oil for the oil lamp so ooh, this is a complex production chain already but sure let's go so we can do this okay and put the oil lamps so hopefully with this we are starting to do all of the productions needed for these guys now it seems to be that my beer we're not making enough beer i think we're making just um let's start this one by the way while we're at it and check again if now that has it still says zero that is strange seems like a bit of a bug because it seems to be still moving, but it's this thing zero. Okay. Um, oh, I forgot a loom, apparently. Sorry, my bad. Oh, yes, over here. So the loom is going to transform the flax into linen, and then the tailor's workshop is going to transform the linen into rope. So this is also actually um, three layer production. So we started making beer, fabrics, and garments. Yeah, they are happy, right? But uh, I'm not so happy because I don't think we are making enough of everything yet. So let's go. I mean, planks, for example, I don't think we need to check that one out. Uh, herbs seems to be fine. So let's put the lambs. But clearly we're not making enough. So we're gonna need to improve those productions soon we are also not having enough people in our city so it's a catch uh, 22 right lack of material what's happening because we don't have it yet but it's, it's gonna start it's gonna start okay uh i did here this one should be why does it still seize one saving it's going all the way over here to take that one. That's crazy. Uh, these two at least have started. So that's something. I do think we also had one there. Is it empty? Yeah, that seems empty. So let's delete it. Because this is 15 people and 10 of maintenance, right? Why can't I? I'm sorry. Okay, that's deleted. Good. So let's take this out. Now, I haven't really seen things like production times. I don't know if that's just me. Um, you know, are we talking about one of these for one of these? Or is it different? In Anno, for example, you know, sometimes it's 30 seconds, sometimes 15, sometimes one minute. So you have that complexity here. I don't see it yet. I guess we can sort of see it into here. If this was working, I don't know why. It was working in the first two episodes, but now it's not working anymore. Somehow it shows zero. Um, but anyway, otherwise life is good. I mean, we are increasing. We are producing not enough of beer, but enough of oil lamps, it seems. Oh, they're not delivering it yet. 
taking a minute to get there. We're gonna want, I think, to start also some of the other productions. We could also start selling. I oh, know I. These are the only things we can sell, at least for now. Um, is there something else we should be selling? So what is important is I don't want to sell something that's limited. Like the stone is limited, the wood is limited, so we shouldn't do this. But the fish, for example, the reality is it is actually unlimited, if I'm not mistaken. All right, it says unlimited, so we could sell a bit of it. Same for the meat. I'd right, get a bit of um, of that in. This way, we can get more money, more tools. Okay. So that is good. Let's uh, move here. We're starting to have some reserves, but I'm thinking we start expanding a bit more the city again. The problem is I think we have covered the radius of this, right? Like this is not in range anymore or just one. Let's put it better than nothing here. We're not in range anymore oh, here. Maybe we are in range. Oh, and by the way, yes, sorry, I forgot to mention, I did build a second of these uh, here. I built a second, this is called again, I forgot, sorry. Uh, no, not here, here. Sophist House. So I built a second one. When I built it, we moved from one technology point per minute to 1.2. Now it has decreased to 0 0.9 because I am missing people. So instead of having, you know, 15, or oh, oh, is, is it, instead of having 15 people working there, maybe we only have 10, right? But so basically, if you build more of these, then you're going to have more, you know, you're going to research faster, let's say. So let's do this, get back into positive for the population, upgrade. Uh, by the way, I would love to have also an um key to upgrade like uh you is a great one <laughs> but anyway now we are back into positive for both of these All right so that's good that's good and we're definitely not making enough beer but the other one seems to be fine so let's just increase the beer production we will need a new noria right there's not enough point noria sorry not noria noria uh so maybe over here to go for it and as we said we want to do first the wheat farm yeah six one two three putting them on the outside and done and then actually sorry my bad I didn't even check. Oh, we have a lot of wheat. So the problem actually wasn't the wheat. My bad. <laughs> the problem was just we need more uh, of uh, which one is it? This one, the brewery. We need more breweries. That's all. So let's build this. Here we can not fit one, but here we can fit one. Hopefully one would be enough. Now while we're at it, we can check also for the others. Like we have a bit of olives. Um, so that's good. We have enough herbs. What is the other thing? The flax. Where is the flax? Here. We have some flax. So yeah, that's good. Actually, that is good. We should be able now to give sustainably all things to all of my people. To be able to upgrade them though, we're gonna need to have four luxury good entertainment, um, culture so we're not there yet for this one though we could potentially increase it soon we just need a bit more linen so we can do that we can do that uh, it's this one here go here perfect because th with this we would be able to make a next level agora pretty cool now we haven't uh, we have finished this bronze age research which give us access you know to some of the mines and things like this we haven't started this one because we need weapons we could do this one stone roads which will improve you know the transportation speed basically 
we could here research the cultural center and actually that's the next mission so let's go for it efficiency of herb gathering we'll do that soon oh ceramic we're again at zero of ceramic i need to increase that one again but we could increase the range of the noria by 50 percent so that would enable me you know to keep this one and put more there and there so that's great and then what else? Uh, the last one is development of breeding. Okay, so cattle farm. So definitely the next one we're gonna want to do is over here and then there. And then we'll have almost finished already the first level. For the next level, we will need, you know, a um, couple of things. In particular, we will need a library. So we're not there yet because that's all going to require marble. But I'm really happy with some of the progress we've made, right? They're getting a lot of things now over here. They're getting a lot of things, so they are very happy now. Could even increase tax even more to make even more money. We have good reserve of everything. Uh, this one, by the way, is it still at one? This is crazy. Why is it still at one? <laughs> I don't know. I guess the... I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. Because there's a warehouse literally next door. It's maybe just because we're full on stone. But anyway, that is not a big problem. We have now some reserves. So yeah, ladies and gents, some great progress with new productions over here. We have the flax. We have the olives. And again, I don't know what you think. You know, going into the options over here, you can see that my graphics are pretty good. Oh no, they are not. They, they were be good before, but now they are not. Why can't it go to high? Sorry, I'm just trying, but <laughs> it is not clicking. Okay, so now it's high. Uh, let's leave it like this. Yeah. Okay, so do you see the difference? Uh, I don't really feel the difference. I still think like in some ways it is a beautiful and in some ways it's very ugly. <laughs> I don't know if you feel the same. It's like some of those textures just don't feel right. But at the same time, I love the detail, right? Like we have a lot of details on all of those models. Anyway, a lot of progress here. We now, oh, the treasure. Let's give it to my people because I have so much money right now. So this way that's going to improve again the happiness. Oh, we are low on these guys so let's uh, put just a couple more by the way in this one this is eight people versus in those ones it's 10 right so that's also worth nothing it's not just more money it's also more people but it's also a different tier of population right good thing is thanks to my two doctors or healer house to be more precise we haven't had any uh, pandemic in this episode so i'm happy with this uh, we haven't um, anything happening here. No, it's not a problem. But yeah, ladies and gents, tell me in the comments below if you have any thoughts, questions. And in the next episode, we move on. We're going to start making weapons and tools in particular. I want to actually create an army because you may remember we lost our army. <laughs> we haven't been attacked yet, but I'm pretty sure that's going to happen at some point. We're going to want, uh, maybe let's conclude this episode by upgrading our Agora once more. Ah, it's getting more beautiful again and uh, bigger too. We're going to continue doing that also in the next episode, right? Getting our Agora to the highest level, maybe get also to the next tier. I don't know, we'll see. We'll definitely have to build some culture too. Thank you for watching and hope to see you next time.